trail mix always tastes good, of course, but we all know it could be a little better. Dr. Ed LaMadrid is here with us this morning to show us how to make a healthy but also a very flavorful trail mix that we'll actually want to eat. Absolutely. Thanks good for morning. joining us. Thank you. Thank you for having me. So, you know, one of the things we talk about is energy. Mm -hmm. And in the afternoon, we all suffer from that, that energy drop. And what happens? We usually go for an energy drink, a little bit more caffeine or a yes. donut. And so this is a way to kind of get your energy back long term. And also because donuts, because things like that are short term energy. And then you get tired again. Why are we drawn to that though? Is there something because psychologically going on in our brain that says, I want carbs or I want sugar or sweets? Well, so they activate the pleasure centers in our brain. Mm -hmm. And they also give us a really quick spike of energy. But then we have a roller coaster ride down. Yes. So now by <laughs> incorporating a trail mix, you're actually able to build energy and sustain it so that by the end of the day, you're still energized. Mm -hmm. So what I brought in, uh, I brought in a little Chinese medicine with a, a fruit called longan root, which is actually a blood tonic. So it's a beautifier. It's great for skin, great for hair, will make you beautiful all around. Okay, well that sounds good to us. Well, tell us uh, what types of ingredients you so have here. So goji berries. Goji berries, which are all around uh, most stores now, uh, is an anti-aging herb in China. So it's great for the eyesight, great for hormonal balance. And so these you would take every day. And that's, that's the key to this, is that the trail mix you want to incorporate into your regular diet. And then you've got nuts like almonds, which research has shown uh, can lower heart attack risk, lower cholesterol. And then you've got walnuts, which are actually brain food. They're rich in uh, fatty acid essential oils. So putting them all together, I've got this great trail mix. Pretty. So this is the longan root, okay. the blood tonifier. And so we talk about making your own trail mix because you can get packaged stuff. Mm -hmm. The only problem is that you don't have much control and there's a lot of sugar and a lot of salt. Usually trail mix comes <clears throat> with M&Ms and some caramel covered chocolate something. So we can get to a little <laughs> bit of sweet for that. Okay. But this should be the, the larger majority of the trail mix. And now, there's also options if you do have any nut allergies. Talk about what so you brought instead. So for our friends that are allergic to nuts, then you want to use some seeds. So we've got pumpkin seeds, which are a rich source of zinc. Mm -hmm. So zinc is great for the immune system and will help you beat off like the seasonal colds, help you with the flu, things like that. Great to know. Sunflower seeds are rich in magnesium and magnesium is a nerve tonic. So it'll help with stressed out muscles. It'll help out with headaches, any kind of aches and pains. Also good. Um, okay, now, let's talk about the sweets. If you want to add a little sweet <laughs> and it's a little sweet. So dark chocolate, is definitely better than your milk chocolate. And you have to be careful. If you're diabetic or pre-diabetic, you want to reduce the sugar as much as possible. So those are chocolate-covered bananas. Just add a couple. If you don't want to do chocolate, you could add something like raisins or dates, which are good. And you could always go with dried fruit, like the dried apricots, dried cherries, cranberries. The only problem is that many of them are dried with sulfites. Okay. And so you have to be careful. If you react to sulfites, then you're going to end up with a headache and you're defeating the purpose. Okay. Thank you so much for sharing all these helpful tips for us. So these are some great ideas, easy ingredients you can get at the grocery store this weekend when you're stocking up for the week and hopefully put together some healthy snacks. We're going to have a whole lot more coming up right after the break.